Yeah, obviously that was a great start. Uh, I think we came together all 60 minutes and uh, I think got, got better as the game went on. So we just got to bring that every night. I think we'll do just fine. And you seem to have things working in all three zones of the ice. Uh, t- take us through what was going so well, particularly in the offensive zone. Keeping it simple. Our defensive play was outstanding, I thought, as the coaching staff said. So uh, if good defense needs to go to offense and uh, show it on the scoreboard. Now, finally, uh, t- take us through what the plans are as far as Russia tomorrow. That's going to be a big game, obviously. Yeah, obviously, yeah, play physical. Uh, they're obviously a very skilled team, so if we just... Simple, keep, keep it simple and play physical. I think we'll do well. All right. Well, Wade Murphy, congratulations on the win to get the tournament rolling, and best of luck the rest of the way. Thank you. No, absolutely not. I mean, uh, certainly we wanted to get off to a quick start and, uh, you know, just play the full 60. Uh, we talk about seconds in our dressing room, and, uh, you know, really the guys did a great job. Uh, speed was a big factor for your team in this game. You were winning races and winning battles, and, and that all started with, with the foot speed of every guy. Well, absolutely. I think, uh, you know, we talked about taking advantage of a, a team that played the night before. So, you know, certainly I give our credit, guys full credit for, uh, you know, bringing it to the game, uh, bringing it to the table each and every shift. And uh, special teams were a big uh, big thing for this team as well. A couple of power play goals, plus obviously the penalty kill being perfect. What was going so right with the with those special teams? I think just paying attention to detail. You know, we made some sacrifices, and uh, you know, this is a tournament. We watched the games yesterday where there was a lot of specialty teams. So certainly, we wanted to make sure that we were you know executing what we were telling them, and uh, you know, just play with some desperation, really. One final question before I let you go. Jonah Emu got the shutout today. What is the plan for goaltending tomorrow? Hey, you know, we're just going to address it in the morning. Really, uh, you know, Jonah played well, and uh, certainly we just take one day at a time. You know, today's Tuesday, tomorrow's Wednesday, and we'll figure it out from there. All right. Coach Dean Brockman, thank you very much, and best of luck the rest of the way. Right on. Thanks a lot. Yeah, as I said, uh, it was a pretty quick start from the Team West, and uh, it was tough for us. Uh, they were uh, a lot faster than our team. I think uh, it's it's tough for our young players. We have uh, five guys that are only 16 years, and uh, when you play against 19 years old, it's uh, it's tough. But uh, I think uh, we improved uh, through the game, and uh, we got three 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 goals that were very bad. But uh, overall, uh, I can't blame the young players. You've got a day off tomorrow to regroup before the quarterfinals. Uh, what are your plans for tomorrow to, to get regrouped and get ready for the quarterfinals on uh, on Thursday? I said my players before the game, we have to improve every game. So uh, we try to improve through every period. And uh, as, as, as long as our player is improving, uh, I'm, I'm satisfied. I hope uh, the recovery will be good and uh, we'll be ready for quarterfinals. All right, well, Coach, uh, good luck on Thursday and uh, the rest of the way as well. Okay, thanks a lot. Thank you.